Austin Public Health is warning people about scammers pretending to be APH employees. And the health department says that individuals or groups are spoofing the phone number for APH's environmental health services line to attempt to scam people. The city of Austin is working to stop this, but APH wants you to know it'll never ask for social security, insurance, or financial information. In Texas, about 49,000 children live with epilepsy and seizures. And for a parent with a child with epilepsy, navigating a complicated health care system can be difficult, especially for those parents with limited English proficiency. And that's why a doctor at UT Health Austin is now opening a special clinic to treat Spanish-speaking patients and their families. The new epilepsy clinic is meant to help tackle the significant health care challenges impacting minority communities here in Austin. What we're trying to do is uh, correct some of these health disparities that we see in the Hispanic and limited English proficient populations uh, through a, a, a language concordant clinic. So through a clinic where the provider and the patient speak the same language. The new clinic is expected to open later this month, but it's in desperate need of a bilingual nurse to fill out its staff. For more information, you can look for this story on our website.